morning guys. Oh, we have Peach joining us today. So it's currently Monday and I'm starting another week of online classes. I am a first year dental student and because of the coronavirus, all of our classes are online right now. We're not allowed to go into lab or anything. So all of our clinical classes are kind of on hold right now, which kind of sucks because I do not feel very confident with my drilling. And I would like to be practicing that, but we can't. We actually start finals next week, but again, we're only going to be doing it for our lecture classes. I'm pretty lucky because as a first year dental student, I have mostly lecture classes, so a lot of my classes can still continue. It would suck a lot more if I was an upperclassman and I couldn't be doing dental work right now because um, all like elective dental procedures are currently not advised to do. I don't think anyone in any of our clinics is doing any like elective dental procedures. I think it's only emergencies. So yeah, I've been doing a lot of online school. This is week two. Benefits of online school include having Peach with me all the time and wearing comfy clothes. So it's nine o'clock right now and that's when my lectures start on Mondays. I'm trying to keep with the schedule. My lectures are not on Zoom conference or anything. They're just pre-recorded. So I have to kind of pace myself, which is good for some people, not good for other people. I think it's good for me because I like to be able to like pause when I need. Sometimes professors talk really fast like during lectures in person and you can't write everything down. So this way I get to like pause and like make sure I understand everything and kind of take a little more time. So it does take a little more time than like if I was just sitting in class with lecture, but then again, I don't have any of my clinical classes. So some days I'm not even listening to any lectures, but I do make myself get through all of my lectures each day. Like today I have microbiology, I have physiology, which we call human structure and function. And then I have oral pathology and I actually got ahead on my microbiology lecture last week. So I don't have to do that today. I'm still waiting for my my physiology lecture to be posted actually. Some of my professors are a little bit slow, uh, which is kind of annoying because I like to kind of just wake up and get this out of the way. So I'm about to start with my oral microbiology lecture. Some of my professors are actually posting lectures early, which is really nice because then I can kind of get ahead on them. I'm trying to get my lectures done as soon as possible this week so I can start studying for finals. It's really hard to like force yourself to listen to lectures all day and then study after. Like usually like you're in class and it's like a different like setting change. So it's easier to like start studying after, but it's been a little bit hard. So I'm just trying to get ahead on my lectures. Some of my professors have just said like, study the slides yourself and not even recorded the lectures. Not for any of my like really hard classes. That's like a little annoying because I'm paying quite a bit of money to go here. So it would be nice if they could at least like record the lecture and not say just like study it yourself. I don't know. That's just like two of my classes, but still it's like, a little bit annoying. I'm hoping that this is going to be over by May when we have our next semester. We do have a summer semester, but who knows. So for my current setup, I have my iPad ready to take my notes. I do like to use my iPad Pro with Microsoft OneNote and I just like can write little notes hello, you know, that kind of thing. Um, and so I can take notes on the slides, which is really nice. And then I have my laptop with PowerPoint open. And as you can see, it like has audio. So the PowerPoint has embedded audio. So I just listen to the audio, change the slides, and then like take notes as I'm watching. I like to have both of them open because my computer is kind of like the projector if I was in lab and then I always take notes on my iPad. So it's kind of a familiar setup. I also have some high caffeine zest tea. Um, it's my favorite tea. No one asked, but yeah, I like the tea. And then I'm almost done with my greens and reds for the day. I'm gonna start having these in the morning again because they just help set up my like digestion for the rest of the day to be really good. And I refuse to skip these because whenever I feel a little bit of a cold or sickness coming on, this just wipes it right out. I don't know how it does it. I think it's all the antioxidants and whatever but these are the first form greens and reds. Link down below as always. And then I have my water. So we're staying super hydrated today. With all that being said, I'm gonna start listening to my lecture. This is the microbiology of dental caries. Super exciting. It's kind of exciting to learn about things that are like more relevant to stuff we actually do. Caries are basically cavities. It's like the disease that eats away your teeth. So it's super exciting. And Ian is making me some breakfast. Ooh, we're gonna have breakfast tacos, so exciting. Whitney Simmons always recommends these tortillas, so we'll see how they are. He's scrambling some eggs, and then this is soy riso from Trader Joe's. Peach, Peach, do you want a breakfast taco? Do you want a breakfast taco, yeah? 
So here's the final product. We got some eggs, the soy riso, some cheese, some guacamole, and then a little side of peanut butter and jelly toast. Couple updates, it's 11.30 now. I finished my first lecture and my other one, my professor was supposed to upload on Friday. And then she said, don't worry, like it'll be uploaded by 10 a.m. Monday at the latest. Like it'll be uploaded this weekend, 10 a.m. latest. And guess who didn't upload the lecture and it's 11.30. So I'm just trying to stay on top of my work, but it's a little hard to stay on top of your work when your professors can't even post your lectures on time. All of a sudden I have two quizzes uploaded. We take exams on this online like exam software. It's like a program on your computer. Um, it like shuts down all your like windows and like browsing and everything. So I'm just a little bit confused what these quizzes are. Everyone's in my class group chat like not really knowing what's going on. So it seems like they might be optional. And then I might just get ahead on my lectures in my other class because I still feel like in the mood to do a lecture and like get ahead a little bit, but I can't do the one that I'm supposed to do. So I might just get ahead on the other one. So I just finished that lecture and I think that's the only other one I can possibly do today. Unfortunately, it's only 1243. Um, Ian and I are gonna do a little at-home workout soon. I've been posting a lot on my Instagram page, so make sure to follow that. One of my classmates also made this really helpful like little like chart thing of all the lectures we have in each of the classes for the rest of the semester. So I just went through and checked off like what I have done so far. And so like you can see like on 4-1, I still have this lecture to do and all that. So I'm just kind of keeping track because it's hard to keep track of everything you have to do when you're not like in lecture every day because like they kind of keep track of it for you. So I'm just trying to make sure I don't forget anything. Right, just made me and Ian some pre-workout before our workout. This is the strawberry pineapple first form. It's pretty strong, so I only use like maybe less than half a scoop, but it's nice because it also has things like BCAAs in it, so you don't have to take those separately, even though I don't really take BCAAs. Um, and then also creatine and caffeine and whatnot. So I'm gonna start drinking this and get ready for our little workout. Well, we're making a post-workout shake. Um, we use the Formula One chocolate milkshake flavor uh, with some peanut butter, banana, and almond milk. So we finally got the lecture uploaded and I'm exporting it to my OneNote now, but they didn't upload any audio. Hopefully she figures it out, but like this lecture was supposed to be on Friday and it's Monday and I would kind of like to finish it today so that I can stay on top of my classwork, you know? So I'll keep you updated. I'm about to take a shower and then have some lunch. It's like three o'clock, but I don't know. We had a big breakfast, so. So it's almost seven, my lecture never got uploaded. I tried to edit a video and then my final cut kept like glitching and like freezing. My laptop is super old at this point, so I don't blame it, but like it's just frustrating when I finally get the motivation to edit, it's like, no. In the meantime, I did some laundry. I packed up some Amazon returns that I need to make. And now I think I'm gonna start dinner. Ian is just finishing up his Zoom class. His class is actually live, unlike mine. So yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna make. I might make some chicken. So Ian brought out some cheese and crackers because he got hungry. So we're cooking some lemon peppered chicken thighs. And then I'm cooking up some of this right rice, which is like rice made from vegetables. I got it from my Instagram. Um, but like they didn't ask me to post or anything, but I actually really like it. Um, it actually like tastes moderately like regular rice and it has like cool flavors as a Spanish flavor. And then we'll probably make some kind of um, vegetable. 
And now we brought out the Wii and we're playing Wii Sports. But aren't you going to... <laughs> Strike! So that's it for the vlog. We basically just ate dinner, watched a movie, and kind of relaxed. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thumbs up if you want to see more of these vlogs, and I'll see you again next time. Bye!